everybody. It's just Amanda today. Welcome back. Uh, as you can see, I'm just kind of showing off our Shining Legends here. We are very excited that we were able to pull all four Mewtwo GXs only by buying two of the Shining Legends Elite Trainer boxes. So we'll definitely have to grab another one of those to see if we can get anything else. But for today's video, we just have five packs of Burning Shadows because we're forever on the hunt for that Rainbow Hollow Charizard. Um, we probably won't stop till we get one. You just, you never know. Could this pack could be it? This pack could be it. This pack could be it. Mitch is at work. Bless his soul. I love him. And so it's just me soloing it up today. I hope you guys are really enjoying our battles. We are working really hard at trying to make sure they're fun and that we have the deck, um, use different decks each time just so you guys can kind of get a feel for it. If you like those type of videos, let us know in the comments. So go ahead and do one, two, three to the front, four to the front because we're in sun and moon. Whew. If Mitchell's here, he'd yell at me. We have Psychic Energy Bodybuilding Dumbbells, Ride On, Electric Boogie Woogie, Hoot Hoot, Lady Ba, Mud Bray, Horsey, Venipede, Giawe, and a non hollow Turtonator. So far, not ideal. On to our second pack here. And if you guys see this little ball in the bag, this is our Pokemon Trainer Guess. It's really cool. It's the Kanto Islands version where if you press the little button on there, it'll actually guess what Pokemon you're thinking of. And it comes with a little guide that gives you hints on like what, uh, how to answer questions and things like that. If you're not familiar with a specific Pokemon, um, its type, uh, where it's located, all of that jazz. It's super fun. Um, we've messed around with it. Uh, my son has played with it, and he thinks it is just the absolute coolest thing ever. We have Fire Energy, Heat More, Curlia, Simisage, Inke, Lady Ba, Caterpie, Sandy Gast, Benipede, Reverse Hollow Ralts, and whoo, Seeker Rare Rescue Stretcher. Guys, it's number 165 out of 147. This is... Fabulous. I would take this uh, regardless of what else we get. Um, so Rescue Stretcher is you put a Pokemon from your discard pile into your hand, shuffle three Pokemon from your discard pile into your deck. So pretty nice. You may play as many item cards as you would like during your turn before you attack. So that's going to be one that I'll have to show Mitch. I'll have to send him a picture while he's at work. And see what he thinks. Because, hey, it may not be the Rainbow Hollow Charizard, but it sure is a beautiful card there. Not as beautiful as all of these lovely Mewtwo cards, though. <clears throat> Get you on the code train. We're on the code train. We have been a little more active on the Pokemon TCG Online. If that is, you know, something you guys are interested in, I'll put our usernames in the description. It's Pandemonium and Fallen Beast. So not too hard to find us. We have rather unique names. So definitely get on there. We're always looking for people to play with us for recordings. We pretty consistently be doing Ethanos 101. But in our most recent one that'll be showing up on Friday, I actually played somebody new. So you guys can see someone else play with us, or at least with me. Mudbray. Uh, what does he always say? Build-A-Bear. Alolan Rotata. And oh, Tabu Fini Rainbow Hollow. Guys, uh, full art. Mitch is missing out on this one tonight. He's going to kill me. But I randomly picked up these five packs from Target. We don't weigh packs. We just pick them up and hope for the best. And I think this is super awesome tonight. Oh, man. He's going to kill me. It's okay. Pack number four. I'm not really sure what these cards that I'm pulling are even worth. Um, 
especially when we pulled from Shining Legends, since it's it's so new. But the cards I just pulled, I pulled that Tapu Fini GX, Rainbow Hollow, Full Art, Good God, it's gorgeous, and the Rescue Stretcher, Secret Rare. I don't know the only way that it could really get better is if I could pull a Rainbow Hollow Charizard or something. So Viper, Rhyhorn, Hoot Hoot, Meryl, uh, Kamehameha Porygon. We actually watched this one video, and this guy was so angry about the fact that the Kamehameha Porygon from the episode in Japan gave kids seizures that every time he pulled one, he literally crumbled it and ripped it up. I will not be doing that because I just don't feel the need. <laughs> Charmander, Reverse Hollow Dupider, non hollow Lydian. So out of four packs so far, we've gotten two outstanding pulls. This is our last pack, Magic Guys. Little Mars Shadow action for you right there. And final code card of the evening. Let me know in the comments what you get from each of these. That would be fabulous. One, two, three, and four to the front. Electric Boogie Woogie Woogie. Super Scoop Up. Plumeria, Cedra, Rhyhorn, Hoot Hoot, Meryl. Here we go. It's a relatively close pattern to the last pack that I opened, and that seems to be a thing for the Pokemon Company. Kamehameha Porygon. I... Charmander. Hey, Olivia, and a non hollow Beware. Still a good card, though. Um, aside from the fact that when you use Tantrum and it does 120, uh, the Pokemon is now confused, so... That can hurt you a little bit. But I'll let you guys get a nice look again. Here is Mitch's Mewtwo GX. Mitch's Secret Rare Full Art Mewtwo. Which seems to be very popular. You guys really like that one. And then here's mine, just a regular Mewtwo GX. And then this Rainbow Hollow Full Art. And then from today's videos, our top pools, we have Rescue Stretcher Secret Rare and Rainbow Hollow Full Art Tapu Fini, which I didn't actually read the um, attacks. It's got Aqua Ring for one energy, does 20, and it says you may switch this Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. Can be a very good move if used properly. We have Hydro Shot, which is two water and one uh, energy of your choice. Discard two water energy from this Pokemon. This attack does 120 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Don't apply weakness and resistance for a benched Pokemon. So depending on what HP your or their active Pokemon has, you could actually take something out that's on their bench, which could be super helpful. And then the GX move for one water energy is Tapu Storm. Shuffle your opponent's active Pokemon and all cards attached to it into your deck. If your opponent has no benched Pokemon, this attack does nothing. You can't use more than one GX move per game. So, great pulls today, guys. Secret rares all around. I am super excited uh, to see where we go from here. Friday, we'll have a battle that's already scheduled, ready to go. I hope you guys are excited. And then we'll get into a little more pack openings. We're going to kind of go back and forth between online game and physical pack openings, booster packs. We have... I think we have a Komo'o GX box to open. We'll get some more stuff here in the next week or so. Um, other than that, give us a like if you enjoyed the video. Comment and let us know what you get in the code cards and if there were any favorites that you have here. Subscribe, hit that red button. Share it with your friends so that they can subscribe too because the only way for us to keep bringing out more content is to know that you guys are liking it and loving it just like we are. And I really hope you guys enjoyed. This is Amanda, signing off.